the government has said, hey, if we don't get a U.S. buyer for TikTok, then we're shutting it down. <laughs> Instagram now has a Tic Tac, Tic Tac, Tic Tac copycat uh, <laughs> called Reels. That is basically it's Tic Tac and it's on Instagram. Uh, so I think that's why Zuckerberg was uh, in front of Congress because they're like, hey, we see that what you're doing. We see what you're going to take over Tic Tac next, aren't you? You're going to take it over, um, which is. Timing of wise, he is. He did that to everybody. Exactly, he did it to Snapchat. He bought Instagram. Like, it, that's 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 the business part of it. Um, right. So, and Nona is very passionate about the TikTok ban subject. So, Nona, actually, have you have you seen anything about the Reels app yet, or the Reels plugin? Basically, in Instagram, it's still in Instagram, um, but it's it's basically they launched it in America. It's been in other countries. Um, and, and it comes out right when TikTok is potentially being banned in America. Uh, the, the government has said, hey, if we don't get a U.S. buyer for TikTok, then we're shutting it down. So they're waiting for a, Microsoft was in talks to buy it. So And Jake, you had that story um, that I sent to you about Microsoft buying it. Um, yeah, and, and as of right now, they've, they've put it on pause. They were going to buy it so that they could keep it in America. However... Now, uh, with this coming out, that I think muddies the waters for someone like a Microsoft to spend a lot of money on TikTok. Now, there's still a bunch of users. There's a whole bunch of there's a whole bunch of reasons you would still want to buy TikTok. However, this coming out, this is a little bit of a burr in the saddle of uh, the TikTok people, Jake. It is a little bit, but uh, hey, let me tell you this: if there's one thing that I did, that I learned from the whole Vine thing, <laughs> right, is that. No, no laughing. I just saw that. <laughs> can't I, laugh. Okay. We can't laugh about it right now. Pulling it in. We laugh about that later. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, but all, I, all I'm saying is that based on the whole Vine thing, what happened mm -hmm. with Vine was that basically something with the NSA, I'm pretty sure, just decided that, that Vine was just going to go away. We were not going to have Vine anymore. Mm -hmm. There was a dedication still to Vine for what it had done from my generation at least mm -hmm. to where even though they tried to move that platform over to Instagram with IGTV and even though that was very different than Vine altogether I don't think IGTV they, was was intended to be uh Vine It was around the same time IGTV no stories stories yeah stories was with stories with Snapchat Yes. Stories they were trying to get back at Snapchat. And Snapchat to kind of took thing. over for Vine. Yeah, it was that whole. Right. And then didn't, I'm pretty sure Facebook bought Vine uh, and then killed it. Well, they that's what they put into their uh, video feature on Instagram because Instagram was only pictures. So uh, I think, right, right, right. I think that's regardless, what they used. Regardless, they're just gobbling them up. Regardless, and the, the, the point is, is that there's a dedication still like there's a group of people that connect to this platform TikTok mm -hmm. is like I, I never would have guessed that TikTok would have been this diverse this like there's a it's literally like going on YouTube from like 2000 the old days yeah and getting yeah it just getting stuck in this crazy thing where you find the most amazing videos like and I'm in the in the part now where you're like all that comes up is like guitar videos and then like cooking videos and it's all tailored to you you basically get to choose what you see based on how you use the app. So, like, I think that there's still going to be this massive dedication to TikTok. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I think that, you know, when it comes to Zuck, he's going to buy out anything he can just in order sure. to be able to, sh to curb the market. Right. He needs to have the he needs to be the guy that's like off the reservation when it comes to taking out competition. Right. And, and honestly, but, it's, it's basically, so I've been, I've played on it a little bit. I showed this like, Hey kids, uh, there's a TikTok in Instagram now, basically. And it's almost identical. There's some of the, the features that you have in, in TikToks that you don't have in reels yet. I'm assuming it's just, it's just coming, but it's just a plug in in stories. Like you can post, you can do live, you can do stories and you can do reels. Um, now I don't know if there's a, if there's a function to watch reels like you watch TikTok. I'm assuming there will be at some point. Uh, but it, it's, it's a very clear, like, um, they are, they are coming after TikTok a hundred percent and just trying to get their users. I think it's also a lot of them saying, Hey, you know what? 
uh, we're just going to take all the users that are leaving because it's gone. Like they they need something to fill that gap. I don't think they'll be able to make it because TikTok is its own animal. It's its own animal, hundred percent. TikTok, TikTok is its own animal, and basically, one of the things that I want to see is I want to see I want to see Facebook fail at this Ooh. because of the fact that like just because of the fact that they've been able to take out everything else, not they've YouTube, been able to curb the market as much as they want to, and. And I will not let it happen. I will fight for my right to TikTok. You'll and, you'll uh, you'll sign a petition that says I I want TikTok to stay. Yeah. Okay. Did you? Okay. So back to the Trader Joe's thing, real quick. That whole thing came over a petition from a high schooler. <laughs> yes. And right. did you did you see what the petition said? Uh, I did see what the petition. I don't remember what it said, but I looked at it. It said it said something crazy. Uh uh oh. Yeah, but it was a it was a high schooler that oh, was yeah, yeah, yeah. like, I want to be part of the yeah. movement. A narrative, a narrative of exoticism that perpetuates harmful stereotypes. Exoticism. I figured that that was a good thing. You see a toucan, you're excited. You it's exotic. I mean? It's exotic. Um, but yeah, so basically, right here, Instagram is saying we're going big with entertainment and making the explore page on Instagram, the permanent place for you to go to, to lean back, relax, and be inspired every day. It's our hope that this will format what we have. It, it's, it's our hope that with this format, we will have a new chapter of entertainment on Instagram. Hmm. It's not a new chapter of entertainment on Instagram. It's someone else's genius idea that you're now like ripping from them because you're the big kid. It's literally lunch money stuff. It's who's going to give me the lunch money, who's going to pay for my lunch, right? Who's going to pay for my Trader Dons, you know? I need to have some Kung Pao, but I can't have my Kung Pao unless I pay for my Kung Pao, right? So I'm TikTok looking, is Kung Pao. I'm looking at it. So you go to the Explore page, and that's where it is. That's where Reels is. I did not realize that. And it's just like you swipe up. It's the same thing. Swipe up. Same thing. There it is. Same thing. It's TikTok. It's TikTok. It's TikTok, man. It's literally TikTok. It's the literally TikTok. About TikTok too, the crazy thing about TikTok, too, is the the algorithm is beyond Instagrams. It, it like based on how long you watch every video, right? Yada, 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 normal stuff. But literally, you have to tailor your TikTok to yourself within the first three days. You have to make your decision whether or not you like the video within the first two seconds of seeing it. Hmm. It's crazy. It's that, absolutely insane. Well, and the, and the interesting thing that I think is dangerous about how that stuff works, which is how a lot of the the technology, especially for younger people, is coming out, is it's so instant. You don't have time to actually see, like, you don't have time to read the body of the article. You just have time for the headline, mm -hmm. right? So well, newsflash, Todd. That's the problem with also. <laughs> <laughs> I, that's true, but I but it's training us. It's training us to be like, it's just the first two seconds that's important, which, I mean, we're human. We, we react in certain ways, but there's something to be said for depth that I think we're losing uh, a so lot much. Of, by, by all of the way that these things are coming out. However, it's, it's working on that dopamine cycle in our head that's addicting us to say, ooh, I like this, ooh, I like this, ooh, I like this. Right, so, and, it, and it, really, it really can skew what we view as important and since we don't as, oh, yeah. as people have deaths deaths <laughs> yeah we do covid we, we do like a lot of that uh, that's a us as people we, we don't like have depth as much as we did anymore mm -hmm. but the people that are like on top of this whole social media game you know they like just look around and they go what are the rappers doing what are the cool guys doing what yep. am i gonna do and a lot of times like i say on the show guns are involved Thanks for checking out the Trending Stories Taking Over Show. If you like that video, make sure to hit subscribe and the notification bell so you know whenever we have a new video and you're aware of any of the live streams when we do a full show. You can subscribe to the podcast on iTunes, on Spotify, anywhere that you listen to podcasts. Go to tsoshow.com, check it out, or watch one of these other videos over here. You're going you're gonna to like it. I, I have a feeling. You're going you're gonna to love it.